When performing a rhinoplasty, oftentimes we need additional cartilage. And the purpose of that cartilage is to fortify and create durability and strength for a long-term outcome in rhinoplasty. Much of what we do in rhinoplasty is reshaping and repositioning bones and also reshaping and repositioning cartilage. In order for those shapes to stand the test of time and to have a result that's gonna last a patient a lifetime, we need to strengthen and fortify those shapes. How we do that a lot of times is with additional cartilage. We can get cartilage from a patient's septum. There's usually a lot of extra cartilage within the septum itself. But if a patient has had a previous rhinoplasty, sometimes that septal cartilage has already been used. In those situations, there are typically three other sources. There's ear cartilage, which is very soft, so sometimes may not be firm enough to achieve our goals. There's rib cartilage, which can be taken through a very small incision underneath the breast. And there's also cadaver cartilage, which is cartilage that's been fresh, frozen, and preserved. And we can use that, which is off the shelf, and we have great success with that cartilage as well.